What's up, people? How are we doing today? This is Mark, the iCloud Helper, coming to you from Cardiff City. And I've had quite a few messages on my YouTube content regarding my previous video of the MDM premium bypass service for uh, Silicon MacBooks. So the previous video I done was actually on a T2 MacBook, but it does cover Silicon Macs as well, which is M1, M2 and M3 MacBooks. Okay. So, um, I've, I've had quite a few comments, uh, quite a few people asking me, can I do a video on uh, M1, M2, M3, Silicon Max for the MDM Premium Bypass? There are a few things I need to add and clarify as well in this video. Okay, so um, firstly, when you, uh, if you've got an M1, M2 or M3 MacBook, yeah, uh, what you want to do is you want to go onto Checkmate's website and basically just uh, put in the serial number of the Mac and then select order the service. Um, when you go through the order, uh, it's only like 30 US dollars. But if you use my promo code, uh, my promo code is iCloudHelper029. And you get 10 to 15% off your purchase for that as well. Okay. Also, I need to add that there is an MDM removal service for MacBooks, iPads, and iPhones, as well as iMacs and Mac Minis. Yeah. However, the, the ratio percentage of it being compatible is very very low it's very slim okay but in the event that yours is compatible and you want to do the removal then I'll have a link in the description below for you to basically check the MDM to see if it is compatible or not chances that it won't be and then you'll obviously have to proceed with a bypass if it's a, a silicon Mac, M1, M2, M3. However, there'll also be a link in the description below my video for the T2 removal service, and that is a permanent removal as well. But that is only for the T2 MacBooks, which uh, is from 2018 to 2020, okay? So yeah, all those links will be in the, the links below my video so check them out um uh, to see obviously if your macbook is um you know uh so you'll do a serial number checker through checkmate and basically to see if it's compatible if it is you know then you're really lucky because <laughs> I, I you know i've tried a lot of devices myself i've run a lot of serial numbers and i haven't you know it's come up as no it's basically incompatible um but with with that aside um so i'll now show you basically how to do a premium bypass on a silicon mac okay because the previous one was t2 and on the t2 one you have to go through the internet recovery now the good thing is with silicon macs there is no internet recovery and it makes it a lot easier, which I'm about to show you now in this video, okay? So, obviously, you go through the setup and there you are, right? Remote management. Okay, you're there. <clears throat> you need to do the premium bypass, okay, <clears throat> to move forward and... I'm going to show you exactly how to do that. So with a Silicon Mac, unlike a T2, all you have to do with this is simply shut it down. And then when you power it back on, hold down the power button and it will go straight into the Mac OS recovery. It's really quick and really efficient. And like the T2, it's quite different. You have to press command option R 
to go through the internet recovery to make sure you get it on the latest Mac OS Sonoma, okay? So as you can see, we have a remote management locked MacBook right here. It's an M2 and I'm about to put it into Uh, the Mac OS recovery. So I'm just going to fully shut it down for now. Right, so it's shut down. So to enter into the Mac OS recovery, simple process, people. All you've got to do is hold down the power button. Keep hold of it. Don't let go. It says continue holding for startup options. Keep holding it. Loading startup options. Keep holding it. And... Let go. Right, when you get here, select the options settings cog, yeah, and simply click continue. Okay, I'll show you the next steps now as it loads. Okay, so English, yes, we're in the UK. Right, Mac OS recovery. Okay, so before you get to this stage, I should have mentioned this, before you get to this stage, what you need to do is when you go on to um, Checkmate's website and you put in the serial number, so you, you have to order the, the bypass service first. Um, and once you've ordered it, you're on a different device. It, it could be on a phone, it can be on a... a a laptop, it could be on an iPad, any type of other device that you can get access to a website to. So it doesn't have to be a phone. But in my case, as you can see, I'm demonstrating it on a phone. So I would put in the serial number there to this Mac. I'd order the service. I've already done that. And so that's what you would do in your case. Right, fair enough. So you know where we're at there. So once that's done, it's quite simple. Um, you enter into the macOS recovery exactly how I've just demonstrated to you. And when you're here, make sure, be sure it's connected to Wi-Fi. Uh, select Safari and continue. Okay, so at the, the top, you want to type this into the URL. You want to type in checkmate. Dot info forward slash code and then enter that there you can either grab the string and copy and or, or just manually type it in but the easiest way to do it is just simply copy to clipboard and now select safari Quit Safari and now simply open on utilities and you want to go into your terminal. Now on terminal here, you simply select edit and paste. There it is and simply now the thread is there. All you've got to do is hit enter and the installation will proceed as you can see. If you do get problems with this, uh, like if, for example, if it gets stuck on a certain percentage and it don't go no further, uh, you may need to connect it to another Mac and do a restore through Apple Configurator. But with Silicon Macs, that's very extremely rarely the case. That's usually the case with T2 MacBooks. So with T2 MacBooks, I would highly recommend doing the full removal. And nothing beats a full removal because it's a full bypass. Uh, sorry, it, it's not a bypass. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? So, yeah. So, once this is done, simply select. So, we got it there. Usen username, admin. Password, 1111. Now, simply just restart.
So yeah, make sure you head over to, um, you check the link in the video, uh, below the video, this importance uh, for the link. So the link for the, um, the MDM removal, if it's compatible, will be in there. So you can just check it. So admin 1111, like it is, and enter. So yeah, uh, also the link for the T2, which will take you straight to the um, the MDM uh, removal service uh, video for T2 MacBooks. And there'll be a lot of other information in there as well, which is very helpful, okay? So look at that, straight to data and privacy, we are good. Skip the process. And also once you're in, everything is fully activated. Everything works, sign into iCloud. You can update the software. Obviously when September comes and the new Mac OS comes out, I'd say hold off on that for a little bit. And once it's compatible for the Mac OS, which comes out in September, then I'll keep you posted on that. So don't worry about that. So there we go. The premium bypass has been done, as you can see. I've shown you clearly in detail and in depth exactly how to do it. And basically the way it's done. Uh, again, premium service. You can do anything and everything. You can update the software on you, okay? So you obviously you're on Sonoma, a new beta comes out, that's fine. So yeah, everything is good, you are good to go. The uh, obvious one thing you cannot do on a premium bypass, on a removal, that's different. But the one thing and one thing only you can't do is the obvious. So transfer or reset, erase all content and settings. What will happen if you do that? Well, it's quite simple. It'll start from the beginning again. It'll go to the remote management. However, if you've paid for the premium service, like you like you have, obviously, yeah, then you simply boot it into the macOS recovery and you can do the bypass as many times as you want on that specific device. Okay, people? Excellent. Excellent. Any questions, just... Send them my way, yeah? Um, again, be sure to use my promo code iCloudHelper029 to get you 10 to 15% off your purchase, whether it's a removal or a bypass, okay? Glad I could help. Um, and that's basically it. So thank you. And I hope this content has helped you people. This is Mark, the iCloud Helper, coming to you from Cardiff City. Bye for now, my friends. Bye for now.